Well, as well. Oh, nice. You know, I love pictures. I love pictures, man. <laughs> this one's cool right here, man. There we go. So we'll hang this one up in uh, Frank's bathroom. Right over behind the toilet. <laughs> there we go. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already go ahead and click that red button right there and also click that bell for notifications and select all all right yo 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 this game's and graphics we are making a building with another gta 5 mod tutorial for you and today we are going to be installing the diamond confinement this one right here is created by crow master mc shout out to the creator when you get down to this page what you want to do is always read the full description before downloading any script or mod after you're done reading the full description you want to come up to right here where it says the current and select the green arrow to download all right now let's go ahead and jump into the requirements we are going to need script hook v and script hook v.net all right all those links will be left down in the description so make sure that you have your requirements installed before continuing further all right once you have your requirements installed and you have your diamond confinement downloaded on the left hand side i have one folder which is tdc the diamond confinement all right on my right hand side i have my grand theft auto 5 directory i have all of my requirements installed and ready to go so from this point what we want to do is create a scripts folder if you don't have a scripts folder go ahead and create a new folder and name it scripts all in low caps like i have here once that folder is created go ahead and open up the scripts folder inside that scripts folder we are going to be going inside this uh, TDC folder over in our downloads. Let's go back to our downloads, go to the TDC folder and open that one up. And we are going to highlight all the contents inside of that TDC folder. And we are going to drag and drop it over here to our scripts folder. All right, once that has been dragged and dropped, we are all good to go from here, okay? So from this point, what I do wanna mention if if you have LS Life installed, I suggest removing the LS Life because that can conflict with this script right here, okay? So if you do have LS Life installed, go ahead and make a backup somewhere on your PC and remove LS Life from your scripts folder, all right? So now that we have that out the way, let's go ahead and minimize any windows that we might have open and run the game. All right, as soon as you spawn into the game, if you open up your map, you're going to see a new blip over here. It's going to have a diamond confinement. That's what it's going to say. It's going to have a diamond blip here <laughs> over at the diamond casino. Okay. This is where you want to go ahead and make your way over to. So let's go ahead and teleport over there. All right. Let's go ahead and walk over into the circle. Press right on um, the D-pad or E on the keyboard. And as you can see, as soon as we uh, walk into the circle and press um, right, the menu will pop up where we have options to change our outfit from the enforcer to uh, laid back or uh, cruel master. All right. So I'm going to pick um, pick any one of these. Pick enforcer and aggressive. You have a weapon loadout. You get to pick also sharpshooter, aggressive or mediocre. Um, pick aggressive and you can select ready to play. Oh, oh, you're here. Why didn't they say something? Man, they never tell me nothing, you know? I'll get it open for you. Much getting through here. There. <laughs> so if you read the description, um, each time that you start this is going to be different. There'll be um, one, I think, one out of three different uh, ways you can start. 
But um, if you look inside here, we have a lot of stuff to steal, okay? <laughs> I had a recent stream not too long ago, man, where I like stole everything out of here. But uh, yeah, it's going to take you a long time to really steal everything out. I'll steal a couple of things just so you can see how it is. Let's go ahead and uh, steal this necklace. Cool. We got some uh, deposit boxes also. I go. Uh, oh, gotta let this cool down. So we'll go and open up a deposit box so you can see that as well. I'll be opening up about four of those. Okay, and let's go over and get this last little diamond right here. stuff we could get as well let's go in here and I'm gonna show you how we can do this uh, one of these lock boxes right here let's see you'll see the instructions at the top left of the screen showing you what to press and what to do so right now we're drilling this side money then we go to the next one so for each of these areas you will have I believe it's about four boxes to drill inside of so as you can see after he's done with a uh, deposit box he just moves over to the next one This one right here should be the last deposit box in this section. We got a little money there. Now, you're not always going to get money out of each uh, little box that you open, but uh, the majority of boxes you will be getting a lot of money from, okay? So it's the same thing that goes around all the way around here. And uh, we also have some pictures in here. We can still as well. Oh, nice. You got love pictures. I love pictures, man. <laughs> this one's cool right here, man. There we go. So we'll hang this one up in uh, Frank's bathroom. Right over behind the toilet. <laughs> there we go. Alright, so I think uh, we got enough stuff, but uh, feel free to, you know, go ahead and steal all that you can carry in here. We have paintings, we have jewelry. Safe de safety deposit boxes. Um, we got everything in here, y'all. All right. So when you're done stealing everything, what you want to do is come out this way over here. Leave out this door. And look at the bottom of the screen. It's going to let you know what to do. So now it's letting us know to go through the man trap. So we're going to continue through the man trap until we get through those doors. We have to exit the casino via the staff door. Oh, we, have, we should get a gun out. <laughs> hey, 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 buddy, drop it. 
Don't move. Alright, so from this point, we just gotta make our way out of here, y'all. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. right now is to make it all the way down um, out the door. Hey, boy, I didn't even see you there, buddy. Get like invisible clock, cloak or something. <laughs> what is it called? Cloak, <laughs> clock. <laughs> all right. So after we have uh, successfully got through all those enemies, you want to come over here, go towards the marker. Be careful because there are a lot of helicopters. I'm just going, I mean, not, not a lot of helicopters, but a lot of, uh, there are a lot of enemies. Okay, a lot of enemies. Let's go ahead and get a uh, buzzard attack chopper. Right on this shit. Oh, wow. Why did they do that? Like, I, I purposely went over the grass to spawn it, and they just spawned it right there. Like, come on, man. And let's hurry up before they start coming out. Okay, so from this point, let's go ahead and open up our map. Open this one up, and we should have a blip right here that says um, 
uh, buyer. We're actually going to have three points, okay? There's going to be a low um, and a high, I think, in the mid also. So this one right here, the closest one that we go to is always going to be the lower, all right? So we have a low buyer right here. Then we also, um, if we go up here, we have a medium buyer, okay? So if you travel to right here, then you will get, um, you will get like more money than a low buyer, okay? But if you travel up here, which is the furthest, this is the high buyer, okay? So this is where you wanna make your way to. And once we get there, I'll show you what happens. Destination now. So let's start landing down. As you can see out there on the beach, there is a truck out there, a white truck that's going to be waiting for you. It's like a white SUV. So let's go ahead and land close to that. As we get close to it, it might just suck us straight into a cutscene. <laughs> Not suck us, but it might put you right into a cutscene like right now. that you will get your pass screen and then uh they will show you the amount of money that you actually won from this all right so we earned just about two million dollars from that <laughs> that was pretty nice total cash earned and that's it so y'all we're gonna end the tutorial right there but if this helped y'all out to install it or if you just enjoyed the video feel free to smash that like button for me Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already e -e 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 and share the video with your friends that are in a modding GTA 5. Y'all, this game's graphics. Me, Big Ball, and Ass Frank. We are out of here till next time. Yep, yep, yep. And Gucci ski goggles, Instagram models Following everybody but God I'm a sinner though I talk to the law Often living large and dealing with temptation is hard I smashed in the Sprinter in the parking lot at the awards I never made it in Fuck it, who would have ever noticed if I even did Low as I is I ain't scared of you motherfuckers